Hello everybody, Mobius1 here, bringing you episode 6 of Star Wars Dark Forces. This one is Detention Center, and we already saw at the end of the last video that this one's going to open up with another cutscene. So, here we go. This contemptible excuse for an officer will no longer divulge any more information to that rebel, Kyle Katar. Katarn will not be as easy to deal with. He is very resourceful. More resourceful, it seems, than even your dark troopers. I understand the threat, Lord Vader. Katarn was once an impressive Imperial officer, but he was weak and gave up on the struggle for our new order. I wouldn't put much faith in his abilities. Katarn will never come near this ship. My new hire will see to that. New hire. Oh man, it's Boba Fett. Alright. So, we're not going to see Boba Fett in this episode. But we may at some point. Anyway, Mission 6. Imperial Detention Center. Orina... Oranka? Orankra? Or Orinacra. Anyway, Trix Medine's Fate. Background. Bad news, Kyle. Our spy, Trix Medine, has been captured. He's being held at the Imperial Detention Center on Orinacra and awaiting execution. He has been valuable, uh, yeah, he has been valuable in supplying us with information on the Dark Trooper, and I think we owe it to him to make a rescue effort. Mission. The Imperial Detention Facility is well secured. Hard to get in, even harder to stay alive. There is a switch controlled shuttle carrier to the facility that will bring you to the main doors. Uh, inside the inside the complex, two main elevators access the lower prison blocks. One goes to the low security levels and down to the command center. The other leads back up to the high security blocks where Trix Medine is being held in the N block. Each cell is located or is locked with its own code card carried by an Imperial officer. So first, you'll need to find the right card to Medine's cell. Since the high security blocks are controlled from inside the block, once the guards are alerted, it will be impossible to penetrate. I suggest you find an optional entrance into the high security block. You'll really be outnumbered here, so rely on stealth rather than firepower. Mission objectives, find tricks, maybe. Uh, this is probably the second level after the um, sewer level that I, I don't really like. And this is also probably now. I'm not gonna say it's the least played level that I that I remember because I'm pretty sure that would be like Nar Shada, which we haven't gotten there yet, obviously. But I don't know. This uh, I do not remember much from this level. Is basically what I'm trying to say. So let's figure it out all over again. Health is 100, shields are at 139. We're doing alright on ammo. Even the music for this mission is creepy. Can I fall there? What is that? It's like a little step here. I don't know what, what's up with that. You hear that music? That's pretty cool. <laughs> the 1995 Into the Trap MIDI remix. Oh 
god, we got probe droids. I see people walking around inside the base. Yeah, this might be really hard to actually get to hit them. Oh, wait, there's some hits. Got one. Got him too. Okay. So we're trying we're just working our way around this this canyon right now. Alright, we're back to full shields. Grab some ammo. Alright, so this switch here is what makes the floating elevator thing come over. Alright, so we're gonna hop on here. Is there a secret area here? No, I guess not. Okay, well that opens the front door to the base. These walls here actually indicate uh, I don't know if they're all considered secret areas, but there's like things behind them. Let's see. Thermal detonators, there's a fusion cutter. Ooh, new weapon. I am mine. A mine. It's just like a landmine. You can throw it down somewhere. Like, I think there's a guy up there. Oh, yeah. So put this here. Does this make that go up, or does that open the door? What did that do? Whoa. Oh, that opened that. Okay. Well, I kind of need to get up there, bro. So these switches, they actually work from shooting them. did but we hit it. I'm gonna try this out. Let's see what's in there. Whoa I killed some dude. Now just shields. Hell I'll take shields. I'm not really sure where I am. We like went further into the base. Ouch. I guess that doesn't open that. Oh well, here we go. Oh god, there's dudes! Is this what we were supposed to do? Where is this? Oh, so we just went the wrong way. Oh, there's a, there's a bad thing there. Is that the only one? Yeah, it 
looks like it. Alright, what we got? Grenades, shields. Alright, we got back up to full shields again. Ah! So much for that! Somebody's still walking out. Oh, hello! This should open. Oh yes, I remember this now. Okay. Why didn't that open? There we go. Look at that. There's another. I'm gonna put a mine down. It was actually my second mine. My only mine. Did that open that up? Oh, shoot. What was that? I think I just blew up another mine. Oh! Okay. Where are we? this, but I don't. Alright. Get into that. Need the red key. So we actually, this is actually where I'm supposed to be? I'm so lost and confused. Alright. So now we're, we're back where we kind of were. Oh, all right, so that's the red key door. All right, so these are the two elevators that uh, Jan was talking about in the briefing. This one does not have an entrance on this floor. Only this one does. So if we get on it... And also that's... All right, so we're on level one. Okay, so Trix Maidine is on level two. I guess that's what the end logo meant. a proximity mine on the floor. So I want to try to trigger it by rolling a thermal... Di oh, no, 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 no! Okay, that was close. I'm going to try to trigger the mine by rolling a thermal... No! God! I didn't know they could hit the dead bodies. That's so dumb. That should be good. Yep. Whoa, those mines have ridiculous blast radius. Okay. Man, they're everywhere. Wow. Alright, so this level has a lot of puzzles to figure out. That looks like that opens, too. No? Okay. So we have a key code here to enter. Whoa. Hey, there's a code. Key, uh, code key three. What is this? Look at all these, like, secret entrances, man. Oh, this one's got, like, an elevator in it? Dude, I don't even know what to do. There's so many places to go. This 
one for some reason lets you see. Why would I care to know what floor I'm on? That's kind of weird. I think that worked. That totally worked. Oh, we just lost our night vision. Okay. It's all right, we'll kill this thing. All right. You'll be a little bit more mindful of our battery power. Uh, the right, there's... Oh! I did not even see that mine on the floor there. And I saw it earlier, too. Stupid, stupid you. Alright. I believe that is all. Let's check that code that we got. QX Triangle. Let's see if that works here. Q X Is that it? Oh yeah, new weapon. Look at this puppy. Yeah, this is like a mortar launcher. I'm, I don't want to use it because we only have 13 shots, but we will use it very soon. Let's hit this and see where we go next. We're going further down. You're in violation of Imperial law. There's another... No! Oh, God. I thought I fell. What do you open? That opened something. I don't know what that opened. Oh, I remember this. These are ray shields. So when that green light is flashing, that means the shield is active. So we have to wait until it goes solid green? Or is, is that what I did? I deactivated it temporarily. I think that's what I did. Because right now you can't go through it and you can't shoot through it. I guess that's what that switch is. All right, I want to make sure, I want to get the rest of the stuff. Hey, there's nothing else to get, okay. So we go in here. Hit that switch, and then we have to run all the way around. And go through. Ooh, that's one way to disarm a mine. There's another switch there. I guess this is to disable it on the way out. Yeah. Okay. So what's in here? A new floor. Let's try that mortar gun. are all de detention cells.
Nothing really exciting here. I don't think this... No, no secret area. Alright, well this was uh, a giant dead end. Alright, so what floor are we on? On the outside of the elevator here, it actually shows you... Alright, so we're basically almost on the bottom floor. Is this going to take us down again or back up? Yeah, alright. So now we're, we're on the bottom floor. This is the one that keeps opening and closing. There we go. Alright. Well, that was, uh... I lost a lot more health and wasted a lot more ammo on two little remotes than I ever thought I would. Actually, we'll probably, we should probably use the repeater for a bit. Sure, what's up with that room? Ah, oh, come on. Oh, so is this this is the other elevator? What about this door? Whoa, hello. Okay, I can't go that way. Like, I'm gonna die. So where does this take us? Oh my god, no! Oh, I remember this. Is this a secret area? What's up there? There are a ton of mines down there. Think those are mines out there? Yeah. Oh, hello. Oh crap! What's shooting me from behind? Oh, the walls. All their shots that miss just reflect back. Stop where you are. Oh, here's ooh two key codes. 
Okay. We're making some progress. I need to find health and shields, though. There are shields down there, but there's no way in hell I'm dropping down there because I don't know if I'm going to land on a mine or not. Oh! Codes. Alright, so we know we have two codes that we can enter here. I bet you that they open these doors. Okay. These are probably like high security prison cells. They got these guys all in solitary confinement. Yeah, alright. Let's see what happens if we open these up. What are our codes? Um, so we used we used QX triangle. So now let's try X triangle, open triangle. X triangle. Oop, that was it. Open triangle. Not that one. Lots of shields. Thank you very much. The other code is three open triangle D. Three open triangle D. That should be this door. Oh, there's a mine in here. Why would there be a mine in here? That's horrible. Look, we're supposed to keep you guys locked up, but we're gonna put you in here with an explosive mine. Oh, maybe they were building it. Maybe the two of them were like constructing a mine to escape. That seems slightly more plausible. All right, I definitely wanna drop down here now, but I've gotta clear these mines out. Oh God, that might hurt me from up here. Ooh. Oh, you know what? We could probably use the mortar gun to clear those out, too. Look at how effective that is. Alright. Well, that's all I can see. Here we go. Oh god, there is one more there. Who just opened a door? That's kind of terrifying. People be opening doors randomly. Alright, I just don't want to step on any mines on my way back here. Okay. We survived. We got 180 shields again. Very happy about that. But, that's all we got. Like, what was the point of coming here? Alright, next. Hey, that's our floor! But we can have this open. Ooh. Oh, almost got crushed there. There's key codes. Code key one and two. That door won't open. All right, so like she said, we can't get in through the front, but I think we did need those key codes, so I'm glad that we got those anyway. Oh, and this is gonna take us all the way back down now? All right. trying to remember now how this puzzle works. 
because the puzzle involves positioning these elevators on the proper floors. Uh, we never went down there. Oh, there's the red key. Okay, we need that. Now, what's the secret with this room? Okay, I remember. So, you take damage when you're walking in this room. But if you look at the far end of this hallway, you can see there's a ray shield there. So, you want to time the run with the shield so that the shield is not active when you get to the other end of the room. Oh, God. Open! Open! That was not how that was supposed to work. Alright, well, now we're down to 29 health. Oh, but you know what? There were a bunch of health pickups down that hallway. The, um... The hallway that was like a detention block, there was a ton of health in some of those little rooms. And I think, I think I remember what I need to do now. I need to position this elevator. We're going to end up coming down here again. I, I can already tell. But I think what I'm supposed to do... So you could set the elevator there. Or you could set it there. Or there. Alright, so there's only three positions. I believe... I believe that is the position it needs to be set to. If I'm wrong, we're gonna have to come down here again and change it. But our first priority is getting our health back. Oh, I'm sorry. I think the, uh, there might be health in here, actually. There is some. Med kit. It is in here, but this is the one where I have to hit the switch. Okay. Med kit! Med kit! See? Oh, so worth it. Okay, now we are at completely full health, full shields. We're ready to take on the rest of this mission. I feel so much better. All right, so now we need to take this elevator back to the top floor. Now, we have to position this elevator correctly, which I believe is that. So we come through here, we're going to drop down, and we're going to drop down and land. We're on, now standing on top of the elevator, and then we can open this and go across and drop. We're now in a shaft between the two elevators. And then we drop down here and land on top of the second elevator. And we can access this door. And that is how 
we infiltrate the detention center. Oh god! That scared the bejesus out of me. So much for our full health. Damn. Hope there's no more of those. <sighs> Dino is. I wonder. Killed it. I don't know if that was the only one. Right, but where am I going here? Right, we need to get onto one of these moving platforms. This. Okay, good. Oh, got it. I'm not on the moving platform. Alright, so this is basically a trash compactor. Uh, if we fall down there, not only do we land in sewage, but every so often the ceiling comes down and crushes you. So, what we don't want to do is fall here. What we do want to do is jump to the other side there. But you'll notice that moving platform over there does not go low enough for you to jump onto if you were to fall. So we need to speedy jump without falling. Should be fun. Speedy jump! Oh my god, you should not be able to do that. Same thing, now we need to go back across over to that side. Speedy jump! Alright. Oh, and that's it. Now we just need to land there. Speed jump! Yeah! We did it! These are all prison cells. These are all locked, I believe. You can see we're on the right floor. The question now is which. Oh god! Which key is the one for Trix Mating? So our choices are codes 1 and 2. So it's either, let's try one first, D, Q, F. D, Q, F. No. Nope. All right, so clearly must be, and I'm curious, how many secret areas did we get? 64%. There are a lot more. Uh, F, X, R. F, X, R. There he is. Okay, Jan. I'm rescued, matey. Don't hang around. Let's get out of here before any more troopers arrive. And we're done. Mission 6. Probably... Definitely the longest mission out of all of the ones we have done so far. Um, but yeah, phew, we're, we're making some pretty good progress with this series. Uh, anyway, thank you guys for watching. 
Mobius one here, and I'll see you in episode seven. Thank you.